Hello everyone and welcome to today's DIY tutorial. I'm thrilled to have you here because we're going to explore an incredible and innovative project, building your own hydrogen generator at home. This is a hands-on way to dive into the world of renewable energy and the best part? You can make it with materials you probably already have at home. Hydrogen energy is becoming increasingly important in the search for sustainable and eco-friendly solutions. And with this project, you'll get a first-hand look at how hydrogen can be generated right in your own space. Whether you're a science enthusiast or just curious about how clean energy works, this project is for you. Before we dive into the process, Let's quickly go over what this generator does. We'll be building a small hydrogen generator that works using electrolysis, a method of splitting water molecules into hydrogen and oxygen by passing an electric current through the water. And here's the cool part. We'll be using something as simple as a shaving blade as an electrode. Watching hydrogen gas bubbles form around the blade is an amazing sight and proof that your generator is working. Imagine, just with a few simple items, you're tapping into the science behind a clean and renewable energy source that scientists are exploring all over the world. All right, let's get into the materials. Don't worry, there's no need to go out and buy anything fancy. All you need is a shaving blade, a small power source like a battery, some water, two wires, and a container to hold the water. If you have a clear glass or plastic jar, that would be perfect because it'll let you see the bubbles forming inside as the hydrogen generator runs. This simple setup may seem basic, but it's powerful enough to demonstrate how hydrogen production works. I'll guide you through each step carefully, so even if this is your first DIY science project, you'll have no problem following along. The first step is preparing the container by filling it with water. Next, we'll carefully attach one end of each wire to the shaving blade and the other ends to the battery. When everything's in place, we'll place the blade into the water. Be sure to position it so it's submerged, but not touching the bottom of the container. This is crucial because we want the electricity from the battery to pass evenly through the water allowing the electrolysis process to start efficiently. At this point, you should start seeing small bubbles forming around the blade, which is hydrogen gas being produced on one side and oxygen on the other. It's such an exciting moment to see those bubbles appear, a clear sign that your hydrogen generator is working. Now, as thrilling as this is, Remember to handle everything with care. You're working with electricity and water, so make sure to keep your workspace dry and organized. Safety first. Hydrogen is a flammable gas, so it's best to conduct this experiment in a well-ventilated area and away from any open flames or heat sources. This small experiment may seem simple, but it's incredibly impactful in showing the potential of renewable energy. Hydrogen is considered one of the cleanest sources of fuel because when it's used in fuel cells, its only byproduct is water. This makes it a fantastic alternative to fossil fuels and scientists worldwide are researching ways to make hydrogen energy more accessible. By making this generator yourself, you're taking a small but meaningful step into the future of clean energy. It's amazing to think that with just a shaving blade and a few wires, you're witnessing the basics of a technology that could help reduce our carbon footprint in a big way. I hope you've enjoyed building this hydrogen generator as much as I've enjoyed showing you the process. If you found this project interesting, please hit that like button and don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Your support means a lot, and it helps me bring more cool projects and experiments right to you. Plus, subscribing means you won't miss out on any future videos. We have so many exciting topics coming up that I'm sure you'll love. If you have any questions or ideas for more projects, please leave a comment below. 
I'd love to hear your thoughts and suggestions, and I'm always here to help if you're curious about any part of the project. And if you know anyone else who's interested in renewable energy, feel free to share this video with them. Who knows? Maybe they'll want to build their own hydrogen generator too! Thank you so much for tuning in, experimenting, and supporting the journey towards sustainable and eco-friendly solutions. This project may seem small, but every step toward understanding and using clean energy brings us closer to a greener future. So keep experimenting, stay curious, and let's work together to explore all the incredible possibilities that science and technology have to offer. Take care, stay safe, and I can't wait to see you in the next video. Goodbye for now.